It's Luke Bowden. Is it? And there it is, the first goal. A slight touch. Oh, the flag is up. Well, that call is not coming from the assistant referee at the far side. He looked offside in the run of play, but the assistant referee on the far side kept his flag down. It was the center referee, Chris Penzo, who called that offside. Controversy early in the match, just eight minutes in. As Kyle Lahren unmarked, where's the deflection? If that ball was touched by Breck Shea, Lahren is in an offside position. If Breck Shea did not get a touch on that, Kyle Lahren should have had a goal to his name. Aaron Mon heading the ball out. Lahren for Orlando. Switching sides, coming down the left side now. Luke Bowden. Bowden working against Plata. Ball floated into Ramondo. I thought it took a touch. Well, take another look and keep an eye on Breck Shea. As this ball struck, does Breck Shea get a touch? As it comes across, okay. oh, you can't tell. It looks as if it might have gone underneath his left foot. That is a gutsy, gutsy call from the referee, Chris Penso. Again, the assistant referee on the far side kept his flag down. And you would think that he judged that ball not to be touched because Kyle Lahren was in an onside position when the ball was struck initially. Chris Penzo makes that call. He must have thought that Brett Shea got that final touch, which meant that Kyle Lahren was indeed in an offside position. 